Hey, hello boys and girls. So this video I'm making for my lovely, lovely CMA students. Yes, this is a relief for you guys and a good news also that institute has revised its paper pattern. And as per the new paper pattern, okay, new paper pattern, uh, there is no restriction on the you know time within which you must complete your objective and also objective questions have been increased which will allow you to solve the paper with ease now okay so now boys and girls it is your time to pull up your socks and perform an exam but yes the exams are there in december and you still have around roughly you know 40 days approximately you still have 35 to 40 days and we are going to make sure that during this you know uh, whatever time is left, uh, more than one month time is left still, each and every day, each and every day, we are going to revise as if tomorrow is our exam, right? And uh, stay connected with uh, us on the YouTube channel. Why? Because daily revisions are going on and I have already announced a revision plan for you guys. Mock tests will also be solved. Whatever mock tests will be released by CM Institute, we'll be solving those also. But as of now, let me, uh, you know, decode the paper pattern for you guys whether it be accounting whether it be law or any other subject for the intermediate and final students institute has kept the uniform paper pattern that is institute has divided the paper pattern uh, into four parts okay part a part b part c and part d now part a is of 20 marks part b is of 20 marks and these part a and part b are fully objective questions fully objective questions okay Part C is of 48 marks. Part C is going to be of 48 marks. And uh, coming to part D, it is obviously now going to be remaining 12 marks. Right. C. Part A and part B, 20 marks full objective. 20, 20, 40 marks full objective. 40 marks full objective. I'll show you one of the papers, say for example, law paper. C. This is part A, 20 marks. 20 MCQs are there. You just have to pick up the correct answer. So, 20 MCQs in which you are going to score 20 out of 20 to say the least. Okay. And if any silly mistakes take place, at least 18, 19, not below that. My student is not going to score below 18, 19 in the MCQ part. And uh, coming to the part B, section B, it is again also uh, containing 20 objective question in the form of true, false. Uh, okay. In the form of true, false and fill in the blanks. Again, one mark of... Uh, one mark each for 20 questions is going to fetch you 20 marks over here. Right. So, it is going to continue, you know, true, false, fill in the blanks like this. Correct, sir. Correct. And now coming to uh, part C. C. So, 20 marks. MCQs are there. Fully objective and it is there. This pattern is being followed in all the papers. Right. And then 20 marks. Fill ups. Correct, incorrect are there. So, these 40 marks are purely objective. Sir, is there any time frame within which we have to complete this 40 marks? No, the time frame is not there. It has been removed. Now, coming to the 48 marks questions, boys and girls. Institute is going to give you 6 questions out of which you will have to attempt only 4 questions. Okay, so which means 2 questions can be left out in the choice. 4 questions will be of 12 marks each. 4 questions will be of 12 marks each. Now, let me tell you, these 4 questions of 12 marks each is obviously going to be 48 marks out of 6 questions you have to attempt it. Okay. And each of these four questions are subdivided into two parts. Part 1 and part 2. C. C, boys and girls. C. Here we go. So, this is your section C. Four questions you have to answer. 12 marks each, 48 marks. Okay. And uh, these questions specifically in law are not case study based questions. These are simple direct questions. Discuss briefly essential elements of a valid contract. So, as per section 10, the essential elements of valid contract, you just need to write the point like offer and acceptance you need not explain everything about offer and acceptance that's not possible okay so you just have to write essential elements of valid contract for six marks all the points of valid contract what are the rights of unpaid seller you just have to write the rights of unpaid seller with one line or two line each okay right sir we got it sir we got it okay and the last part is going to contain one case study. In all the papers, the last part that is part D is going to contain one case study of 12 marks. There is no choice in it. Right, there is no choice in it. So, the last part is going to be your case study of 12 marks. And uh, a case study will be given and the case study will be divided into sub question. Okay, like this is a case study which has been into sub question, sub question 1, 2, 3, 4. Right, and you will have to answer it. Correct, and there is no choice in it. So, this is a friendly paper pattern. Okay, 
and uh, now it is your time to pull up your socks and give your best okay do not think about uncontrollable factors what factors are not in your hand you should not waste time by thinking about the uncontrollable factors what is in your hand it is to study so study very well okay and stay tuned to my youtube channel daily i am coming 9 pm live for you guys we are solving pyqs and uh, cma inter mock test paper will also be solved by uh, our entire team of mepl faculties for each and every paper cma inter also cma final also okay so stay tuned boys and girls stay tuned right thank you and yes do inform your juniors that uh, diwali bumper offer is going on those who have not taken the classes yet they can avail the classes okay at uh, lowest price of the entire year okay and stay connected with the channel boys and girls lots of marathons free revisions mock test sessions are coming your way of not only my subjects of accounts law audit but also of other subjects which are provided by mepl you know now that we are providing uh, all the papers of cma foundation cma inter and cma final and the best faculties are available on this platform okay so stay tuned to the channel thank you for giving so much love and we are going to reciprocate and we are going to clear the exams in this term do not opt out unless you are medically not fit don't opt out okay it's a trap don't fall in the trap thank you boys and girls lots of love take care bye bye Lots of love. Bye.